This is the SharePoint home page, also sometimes referred to as the SharePoint site directory page. Let's go through some of the components of this page. So depending on the permissions you have, you'll see some of these things. For example, you'll see the create site, create news posts. If you have uh, capability to do so, if you have the security or authorization to do so. And then you have the following section over here. That means all the content, all the sites that you're following. You follow a site by going to the following wording over here, clicking on the star, and that's how you follow a site, and it shows up here. You got the recent sites here, so anything that you've been to recently will show up here. Featured links, you can actually edit if you have the permission to do so. You can add links right here to other sites, other content, whatever. Now, news from sites being aggregated and shown over here. Frequent sites shown over here. Then you also have the SharePoint app bar that you see on the left of the screen right there. Now, this app bar, this will just bring me back to the same page, SharePoint start page, no matter where I am. So it could be on a, in a different site. For example, I'm, I'm here, I click on this and I get back to the SharePoint site. You have the My Sites showing you all your frequent sites, your followed sites. You got your news being rolled up from different places and showing it what's important to you. And you got your files, pretty important seeing all your files right here in the view. So your SharePoint page, your SharePoint site directory, all the content that's relevant to you being shown to you. You can get back to it anytime by clicking on the SharePoint start page or also clicking on the SharePoint link right here.